the National AIDS Program Secretariat, and by extension, the Ministry of Public Health, is making a call to persons living with HIV to reduce your risk of contracting COVID-19. If you are living with HIV and you are not on treatment or you are not virally suppressed, you are at increased risk of developing the most severe form of this disease, which will require hospital stay and in most cases, ICU care. It is also very possible that you may die. Why? The HIV virus, as you know, attacks your immune system, making it difficult for your body to fight off any infection, COVID-19 included. If you are already on treatment and continue to use it, as the doctor advised, well done. If you have never used treatment for your condition, I encourage you to call the hotline at 227-8683, extension 215. And we will direct you to the nearest treatment center in your region. If you were on treatment before, but stopped taking it, please visit your treatment center to be restarted on your treatment. This is how you can help us to help you. I mentioned viral suppression earlier. This simply means that as a result of using your treatment, the HIV virus is under control and your immune system can now fight other infections. What else can you do to protect yourselves? Stay at home unless it is absolutely necessary to come out. And if you do venture out, please wear a face mask. Maintain social distances. Eat as healthy as you can. A balanced diet goes a far way in protecting you. Avoid smoking, using alcohol or illegal substances such as marijuana, cocaine, ecstasy, and heroin. Exercise at least four times weekly. Practice cough etiquette. Wash your hands as often as you can. For all of you who need additional support for that balanced diet I mentioned earlier, the National AIDS Program's Secretariat Food Bank is prepared to work with your treatment site to provide you with food hampers. I do hope that the information provided today was useful to you and that you will follow the guidance as was provided.